to finish your drawings while messing up, or at least likely to mess up, and have the end result be beautiful, here are my advice. Use a, a pencil, mechanical pencil or a regular pencil, like those standard pencils that you see in schools. I like prefer the mechanical pencils because the legs of the mechanical pencils are a little bit sharper than uh, the normal pencils in my opinion plus they have like less likely to break of course to a certain extent and I advise with a pencil you always have an eraser and I advise regardless if the eraser is attached to the pencil use buy a bigger eraser that way the eraser on your pencil can all have more of a lifespan and I just believe that the eraser the eraser on your pencil should be like just in case you've got like little mistakes that you want to change but the eraser might be too this era the big eraser might be too big to undo kind of like a duo team per se and I hope that part makes sense but uh yeah besides using a pencil and preferably a eraser too just in case if you mess up I advise you guys to retrace your drawing in pen that way each detail can pop more and then the final result after you, you trace your drawing that you did in pencil and pen and this is after you ha have corrected any mistakes that you may have made in your drawing your pic picture in your pen with your pencil <coughs> so yeah after you finish drawing uh, your picture in pencil and using your er eraser just in case if you make any screw ups and after you have traced your lines in pen I advise then you to color it other in crayons and watercolors uh, pencils and color pencils and markers or if you want to go even crazy your chalk because if you do, if you uh, draw in your uh, pencil first and then color in, like color your picture and then trace it in pen, it's only going to make your life harder. Because I used to do this back when I was kind of starting to draw. I used to draw my picture, then color them, and then trace the lines in pen. And that was like a headache because sometimes the ink wouldn't go on the uh, part of the drawing you're trying to put on. And it's not necessarily the pen's fault, it's like might be the texture of the crayon or the watercolor pencil or the pen that are the uh, marker that might be interfering with your pen to put his ink on the paper that's why I always reckon that's why I that's why you see me in my Christina Grammy drawing how to draw video and my future how to draw videos where you're gonna see me say use a pencil to for to draw your picture out use a eraser to just make sure just in case if you make any screw ups then you can go back and do those mistakes and fix those. Then use a pen to trace your lines that you you've already drew to make the details pop. Then color them to have a more of a effective, a more pretty approach. And here's another thing: if you do it in pen after you color, then you risk making the uh, picture look ugly. Cause I had a few pictures uh, where. I did pencil first, color second, pen later, and I had a few pictures that looked ugly because of that. So yeah, 
Anyways, yeah, my, uh, uh, I, I, yeah, my advice would have the most effective way of drawing is use a pencil and then have a eraser by you just in case if you mess up so you can fix those mistakes with your eraser. Then use a pen to trace those lines to make the uh, lines pop even more and have the end result of the drawing even it make look even more beautiful and then crayon to make the drawing even more beautiful if you you if you so decide to color your drawing so anyways I hope my advice has been helpful if it has, leave a comment below, like, share, you know, the drill. And if you want to see more videos of mine, if you want to see one of my new videos pop up, please ring the bell. And oh yeah, okay, so see ya.